Good morning, guys. So, oh, it's a little zoomed in. Good morning. So I'm currently on my way over to a dentist appointment because I need to get my teeth cleaned. I still am getting my Invisalign. I just have to go to a dentist and a periodontist before I go, and I've been trying to find a dentist out here in LA to go to and a periodontist, and I've never had a periodontist before, so it's all like, I'm just trying to find people to go to. I've been putting it off for forever, but it's currently 9 a.m. I'm on my way to my appointment, and after, Aaron's going to meet me here. My voice sounds very deep right now because I am pretty tired. <laughs> Aaron's going to come meet me here and then we're gonna drive over to Hillary's house and we're hanging out with Hillary today over in the OC. Aaron is going home in a few days so we're trying to do as much as we can before he leaves so yes I am going to head to my appointment and I'll probably see you guys after that. Oh, that's a cool billboard. Cute. I love these shot on iPhone ones. Oh, I gotta go. Okay, bye. Hi, guys. So we're in the car. Hillary's laughing at me because she's mocking me. But <laughs> we are all together yet again, three best friends. And we are going to get some lunch. We're going to a Japanese place that Hillary's taking us to. Very excited. And I just have a little bit of a story for you guys today. So we were essentially scammed by a celebrity. Let me just back it up for you. Um, to about three years ago when I first met Hillary, she is the biggest Jonas Brothers fan I've ever met in my entire life. Me, I was a big Jesse McCartney fan. Um, I had like a devoted email to him and like my wall plastered and that's like on a scale of one to 10, like a one compared to Hillary's 10 of being a Jonas Brothers fan. <laughs> Basically, Hillary's just a really big fan. She has like Nick's dog tag from like when he would it's sell those. Diabetes dog tag, okay. Diabetes dog tag. Essentially, like this, we're totally kidding by the way, like Nick Jonas is awesome, but Hillary texted me <laughs> like seven months ago, Remy. Nick Jonas is having a meet and greet at his concert for $20. We need to go, blah, 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 like freaking out. I'm like, Hillary, like I don't, I was always very skeptical since the beginning. Essentially he scammed Hillary, not me. I, I kind of I kind of knew. From the beginning I was like, Hillary, like that's too good to be true. Like $20, like I don't, I don't think so. Like Hillary goes, Remy, $20 and you get a hard copy of his CD. His CD's $13 and like something cents. So essentially we're meeting him for $6 and some change. Like <laughs> word for word, I'm not kidding. $6 and some change. And in the email it does say you get a group photo with him so Hillary was like convinced you get to like hear him sing and then you also get um, to take a picture with him and I was like I don't know Hill like it says a group photo like I don't I don't really know the other day I get an email randomly that says hey like hope you really enjoyed coming to Nick Jonas's um, sound check like here are all the group pictures like a, a Dropbox link and Hillary I call Hillary immediately screaming I'm like Hillary what's going on because we hadn't gone yet and it said like thank you for coming so we were really confused and we're also gonna get hit by a car. I like click the Dropbox link and I start laughing so hard because the group photos is when he goes to the city and he's on stage doing a sound check and he just like awkwardly <laughs> squats down just a little bit while people are surrounding the stage and if there's too many people it's really dark so you can't even see some of their faces and it's honestly just like the funniest thing ever. So Hillary's boycotting, she's crossing her arms for Nick Jonas. <laughs> She's no longer a fan. She's very upset. I still am a fan. I'm still interested in marriage. <laughs> wow. This is, it looks like green ice tea. Cream. Green tea ice cream. There you go. I love it. <laughs> we are going to the best ice cream place ever. It's called Chillos. That was so sweet and lovely. It's called Chillos. <laughs> you guys, look at the ice cream flavors. They're all so pretty. There's blue cow. It's salted Oreo ice cream. This like pretty lavender. There's pink. <gasps> look at this. Is this like Italian ice or something? Look at those colors. They're so pretty. What skills? You guys, Omi just tagged me in this. I'm literally on the IKEA site. That's so exciting. I love IKEA. I literally just asked them if we could go to IKEA today. Did I not? She did. I love IKEA. Ah! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. This is so cool. You guys, I got my ice cream. It looks so like the, the, the one, like, good. Do you remember when they yeah, did they animal did? cracker. Look at That's these. Nice. She's still a fan, don't worry. <laughs> Ooh, that shoulder, that shoulder. Look how cute this is. There's some little like tag things where people write whatever they feel like writing on there. We got like some tic-tac-toe. Lots of words. These are the fun letters you can use to like spell out words. There's some swingy chairs, some couches. Hi guys, 
So it is actually a few days later. I have been super busy lately. I've been editing videos and I just filmed my apartment tour today. I've been working really hard to get this place spick and span. Aaron's been helping me. Thanks, boo. Yeah. And so I finally got this place super clean. I want to leave it as a surprise. I want to show you guys, I'll show you like a little clip just because I'm really proud of myself for how clean it is, but you also have to wait until my actual apartment tour and room tour go up to see. Of course it's a little messy now because I had to change. Imagine this little bit of clothes weren't there, but look at this. It is so clean in here. Daisy and Aaron are bonding. Daisy's little stick is there that she loves playing with. That's a bully <laughs> stick. My kitchen, everything's just super clean. My filming room over here. We vacuumed, we got it all done. I'm so proud. Anyway, so I think the last day that I talked to you guys was Wednesday and it's currently Sunday. So it's been quite a few days. I'm really sorry. I went and got my hair done again on Friday. I got my extensions put in and it's very light as you can see. Some of my extensions are peeking through. So yeah, I got my extensions done with Grace and she did an amazing job. If you guys wanna see, I posted an Instagram all about it and it looks so pretty on Instagram. Like seriously, the picture looks fake. There we go. I painted the wall just to make it look like it matched my theme but it looks so good you guys and you should totally go follow grace if you haven't already this is her instagram it's grace zip oh she posted a picture with me i love her ah, i just saw this for the first time okay this is grace's instagram grace zip oh i just realized i forgot to text her back too that was my bad i'm sorry grace everybody go follow her if you haven't already she's awesome and i really like watching her stories too she's got really good stories and she does like little skincare things all right so things have been a little bit crazy and they're about to get crazier because what are you doing? I'm about to go get a tattoo. Ah! Aaron's going to get an you'll inner, see, you'll see. yes, you'll okay, see. Tattoo, yeah. he's going to get a lip tattoo and we're going to head out right now and go check it out and stop at the furniture store that we saw the other day because it was right next door and check and see how my order's going and I'm just so excited, yay! Hi guys, so we made it over to Sunset Boulevard which is where the furniture shop is and I just wanted to give a little bit of an update because my vlog went up today where I opened up my Kylie Cosmetics box but a lot of my order was missing and a lot of people were like freaking out on the vlog I didn't know that many people were going to freak out about how like oh like that's Kylie's like Kylie sucks and like all these just mean things and yeah people were like not being very nice but per I've had nothing but like great experiences in the past ordering from Kylie Cosmetics. I think she seems like a really nice girl and I know that she's very controversial but um, just know I emailed them they were so nice about it and like the thing is that's why I wasn't mad before like I like how she's not mad and like I can't get mad it's like a business it's like you know that kind of stuff like it, it happens. Oh I can't read. We came into the store and I felt a little judged but um oh whoa kick it over what was i saying oh yeah things happen like this all the time like i've had things like from forever 21 get messed up like norm like other companies too like not just because of kylie's and like that's why i wasn't upset like i was just like laughing because i have really bad luck but that's why i was laughing so um everything got settled they were super nice about it super understanding they just asked me to send a picture of what i received in my order and or like the receipt thing and they got a new one sent out to me i haven't gotten it yet but hopefully it should be here in a couple days and I'll let you guys know when I do get that. But we're in this fun furniture store now. We're gonna look around and I'll see you soon. Okay, bye. Maybe only like the second time ever that it's uh, like that it's not like a, like two people getting the same thing. <laughs> Just, I, I tried to convince her. No. Nope. She wasn't having it? No, thank you. You need to hold my hand. Everybody always wants to hold my hand when they get Honestly, them. Maybe. They squeeze when they get so them. hard. Yeah, lay. One time I have like scars. On my really? hand from her squeezing so hard her nails. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Yeah, it, it barely goes in your skin. <gasps> oh my god. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna have to swallow it. There's nothing else to do, man. <laughs> That's life. How was it? I was really worried for you. I couldn't breathe. I can give you a little cup of water. You can switch it around in there. Sure. Ooh. Oh my god. How do you feel? That was so fast. I'm so like. Numb that was the right fastest now. thing I've ever experienced. Once like the first like week or so, the way it is after that is pretty much just how it's going to be. Ooh. I'm like, do you want to see it? Yeah, I do. <gasps> oh wow, it looks so, oh sorry, I wasn't even filming it. Let me, let me draw, let me draw it a little it bit. It looks so good. Really? Yeah, really good. Oh my god, it's so cute. It looks <laughs> really <laughs> good. Let me see, let me see it. Wow. It looks so good. Oh my god, thank you. How did you do that? Don't eat, don't go eat curry right now, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> 
Oh my god! I knew you were in pain. I was worried. I was so worried when it was happening. Oh my god. All right, god. few things to talk about. Aaron just got his lip tattoo. <laughs> First of all, like I, when he was doing it, it looked like it was gonna be like your whole lip, so I was like kind of worried. And then it ended up it being this really big, little. But it's so tiny. Also, can we talk about how cute he was? He was so cute. He was really funny at the end. He was like, "All right, well that's it. Have a nice life, guys. Bye." Because like we're probably never gonna see him again. But it was great. I'm so proud of you. How do you feel? Like relieved. Liberated. I was like, I was like really nervous, but like that was nothing. That and like you cannot tell at all, which I love. No, that was so cool. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited that I was ah! here to experience Should it. Oh, we got across the street, go into the car, and go get some dinner probably. I'm getting pretty hungry. How about you? Yeah. All right. Getting some food. So cute. Oh. So we came to dinner at Maggiano's at the Grove, which is this really bomb Italian place. It's your first time. How do you feel? I'm feeling great. Yeah, feeling I'm on great. Top of the world. Good. We're eating some bread, and I see you just posted your Instagram. Hi guys. Okay, we came over to Home Depot, <laughs> and we're getting moving boxes because. Of course, the day that I film my apartment tour is the day that I need to start packing up my apartment. I'm such a flop. Anyways, we're here getting boxes and Aaron's getting a rolling thing. <laughs> look at the look on his face. There we go. It really wasn't that loud. It wasn't too bad. It felt so loud. Okay, we're getting extra large boxes. Okay, you ready? <laughs> One, two, three. Oh. <laughs> yeah. You think that's good? It's the right size? Huh? This is know. different. I'm gonna turn this off. Wish us luck. Don't hit the truck. Ah! Oh my god, I'm scared. <laughs> I don't even know where he's going. So we loaded my car full of my boxes and it seems to be a little tight, but you know what? I think we're gonna be okay. We're pretty close to home, so I'm just gonna drive slowly. They're like so heavily like packed in there that I don't think they're gonna move unless they go like 90 miles per hour, but don't worry. We are only taking side streets because we're only a couple miles from home, so we're good. This is great. Work it, work it, work it, work it, work it, work it, work it. <laughs> do, do the stick it. 